Okay. I want to walk, but I don't want to walk. <laughs> that is always the constant battle. Is I know walking is great for me. It's very beneficial. I even enjoy just being outside. But then there's that other voice that says, you know what? You got a million and one things to do. Why are you adding this to your list? You know, I don't know. For you that don't know me, I've got four kids, a wife, and two dogs. <laughs> it's a family circus, but it's my family circus and it's very busy. So, I'm adding a million and one things on top of my million and one things. But, discipline, I'm finding out through studying other people's um, philosophies on discipline, reading, and all that good stuff is that discipline is thinking about the hard thing that you got to do, not wanting to do it, and doing it anyway. So, here I am. I don't really want to walk because all I can think of is the a million and one thousand things I got to do. Another thing I want to talk about is in building confidence, you have to think about all the reasons why you're not confident. One of them is probably because you're worried about what other people think of you. And when you're in a situation, when you get embarrassed, no matter what it is, even if you're by yourself, you can get embarrassed, but that's another story. Embarrassment sort of all boils down to you worrying about what other people think of you. So let's see, I have a million and 73,000 embarrassments in my life, maybe more. It's a pretty long list, things that have happened that I can't seem to let go of for whatever reason. You know, and it's a work in progress, don't get me wrong. But uh, I want to say that I have a so, sort of a success story from yesterday. Because when you overcome, when you overcome the embarrassments, you overcome the inability to gain confidence. So in essence, <laughs> getting over your embarrassments, sort of falling into your embarrassments, because they're going to happen. You don't just stop doing things that can embarrass you. You gain confidence. So yeah, <laughs> I tripped on air. Yeah, I fumbled through that sentence. Whatever it is, that's okay. You own it and you become more confident. So yesterday, uh, I was partnering with a, another staff to do a job interview. And uh, to be honest with you, job interviews are not my favorite things to do. And I won't go into the details, they're just really not my, uh, they're not my skill set. They're not in my skill set. So anyways, we're getting started with this interview. And uh, I knew it was going to be hard. But I also knew that I had help. And uh, if I dropped the ball, someone was going to be able to pick it up. So that was a nice little net, so to speak. But anyway. I start talking, I just go for it. I don't even think, I just go for it. And uh, I'm doing all right. I could feel my face getting red because I know I'm on the verge of, of uh, rambling. And, and, uh, <laughs> and so I just look at the partner who's uh, interviewing 
uh, with me and I just go, <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> like I hit a wall <laughs> and uh, you know, it was embarrassing. Our face was red, but I still knew that it was a lesson learned in that moment. I was embarrassed, but I stopped caring what anybody thought about it and knew that it wasn't the end of the world. And uh, yeah, I, I, it's the small wins that we get that create the absolute victory. So I wanted to share that with you as well. Uh, this is Papa Ken. I'm on a journey to find, oh, excuse me, no, I'm more, yeah, I'm on a journey on discipline. Learning my own discipline, how to become more disciplined, and a journey to be more successful in everything and anything that I want to do. I'm also into comic books. You'll see videos about comic books. You'll see videos of me playing guitar and singing, original songs and cover songs. Right now I'm going to focus on exercising more, different points of view about discipline, struggle with discipline, and other insecurities that can lead to having discipline and growing as a human being. Uh, so please like this video, subscribe to my channel and comment below. Let's have a discussion. Tell me some of the, uh, tell me something that's been embarrassing to you that you've overcome, uh, the insecurity that comes along with that. And, uh, this is Papa Ken signing off.